Let's go to Oyo State now, where the governor, Shei Makinde, has announced short-term plans to mitigate the effects of the subsidy removal on residents of the state. The governor in a statewide broadcast earlier today said that food security, transportation, and other sectors are among the immediate areas being targeted by the government to alleviate the difficulties, the economic difficulties facing residents of the state. Also, following the recent strike embarked upon by the state workforce, the governor also said, also directed the civil servants to resume duty, duty posts on Monday, as his government will pay the two months deductions owed to them with their August salary, as well as explore further options on dialogue. Following the pattern of our actions during the COVID-19 pandemic, we are updating our social register to include 200,000 of the poorest of the poor. This will be provided with immediate food relief packages. As usual, we will ensure transparency in the registration process so that only those who qualify will get this immediate relief. We will be providing health insurance for 100,000 of our most vulnerable citizens. We will be paying their one-year health insurance premium under the Ohio State Health Insurance Agency, OSHA scheme, so that they have access to quality health care without paying out of pocket. The Omitutu bus service will be extended to cover intercity routes from Ibadan to all other zones of Ohio State.